the third day of navratri worshiping the mother the female in all forms deeply involved in trying to understand and to give back the love and the toughest work that they have gone through without complaining early morning to late night or maybe when throughout the day and night when you are sick or when you are born such was the beauty of such festivals organized by the hindus in india parvati the goddess the wife of the hindu god lord shiva goddess of love and devotion the the word parvati itself is love and it is not the dictionary love it the love which blooms deeper and deeper and only love there is no other thinking if you love they say you have to accept that there are hundreds and thousands of roses in the garden and you cannot tell that you shouldn't see other roses also parvati is the goddess of love they say love can move mountains and love could move even the lord shiva the most powerful feeling the powerful ornament of a religion called the hindus goddess of love and here in the materialistic world here in this world we can find love means always suspicious love means to always think whether to give or take love means is a dictionary love but what parvati the goddess talks and parvati the goddess is love means you are love the mother parvati the female parvati is love means you are also love whether it's a boy or a girl it is born from that mother means you are pure love in the purity of your love nothing can come in between because as the saying goes love can move oceans and mountains love is full of fire and in the fire anything else can melt not destroy please try to understand when you think of fire the people who interpreted they thought it was fire to destroy the fire in the eyes the fire in the heart when you see your lover that means you are melting you just melt into the coffee cup to become a beautiful coffee the sugar melts in the coffee yes and sugar and the coffee becomes one that was the love and the interpreters took it in different ways and created pictures of a fierce full looking lady and i do not know from that fear came the stories in the films that the devils all looks where the white side is long hair and they suck your blood kill you no 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 that was not the love love cannot kill anybody love is just melting to become love trying to take melt with you so you and that your 1000 power 1000 man power melts with that opposite partner 1000 man power and that lovers family friends connected together what a strength it's a big army when that was discussed people thought oh my god they are going to for a war a big war an army no 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 that army is only to make sure that we can work together instead of five hours of work five minutes can be finished in rakum school in indranagar 
people bring a huge amount of things sometimes a lorry load of things and we will just call children come down 100 children comes down and even the baby kid also everybody comes and within five minutes empty <laughs> instead of calling two three people and it takes one hour two hours that was the army what the law of army yes i used to tell my children who get married that when you go to your husband's house you must understand you are going like a thousand men army. You are a thousand men army. You have your family, you have your friends, your relatives, a thousand, thousand, thousand. When you go to your husband's house, don't find fault. Instead, try to take that army, melt with that army, love that army, understand that army. It might take five years. Take that power, your power and that power, can you believe? You are getting a new world altogether, completely on a plateau, on a plate, free of cost. And they give you the freedom to just take it. But there might be a little pain because people will be pulling this side. If you suspect and you go, you might not get it. Utilize that power. That was power the, the goddess, goddess of love. And devotion, when you get deeply involved in the love, and when you become the love, when you and your husband become one, you, you and your wife become one, you and the children, your family, the job become one, then you don't have to use even the word devotion. You are devoted. Means come, means come, means go, means go. You will not ask why. I had a friend who was, uh, of course, a liquor uh, king. I was sitting with him and he called his wife and said, Come, we will go. And she asked, Where? To? And he said, If I call, will you not come? And she smiled. <laughs> Such a love. And she dressed up and came to bed together. He just said, if I call you, will you not come? Even now I use the same tactic here. And with my children just smile. I said, oh, you will not eat if I ask you to eat? Finished. <laughs> love melts. That is devotion. That devoted thing don't need any extra medicine. Any extra and high energy drinks to push things. Love and devotion. That was Parvati, the goddess. That was the wife of Shiva, the lord of the lord Shiva, the, the god of the Hindus. And the Parvati is full of love and devotion. That love and devotion is what on this festival they are all coming to express and demonstrate what they were done the last one year that they moved oceans and mountains through the love, hatred out, diseases out and they were more and more creations and all that became so much devoted they couldn't think of looking into a TV or mobile when your lover is in front of you, which mobile and TV is yes, that devotion. Yes, is unimaginable. Yes, when only the lover knows that deep down, it can be the lover of the family, lover of the plants, lover of the nature, rainwater. And then you go to harvest the sun, the solar, the wind, all is that. That was the beauty of this festival. Demonstrate, yes. And all the people go because they wanted to say thanks to that Mother Parvati of love and devotion. And they put that picture, that idol, and they do arati so that they really melt. Like how Ramakrishna Paramahamsa, she just dances in front of Kali and he forgets that he is Ramakrishna Paramahamsa. He is thinking that he has entered into Mother Kali's body and Mother Kali is he himself and he dances like Mother Kali. That should be the way. Husband melts to become the wife. 
and the wife means to become the husband. That's what in the English language say, you should keep your feet in another person's shoes. This is it. That means you melt. So there is no indifferences at all. 